staying on the topic of young talent, we caught up with an inspirational Egyptian actress and women's rights campaigner, Minna Shalim. Minna is a decorated performer best known for her role as a domestic worker in Nawara, set during former President Mubarak's regime. During the Ilguna Film Festival, she explored her other passion, female advocacy, in a panel discussion titled Women's Empowerment Through Film. Minna Shalabi, a warm welcome to Inspire Middle East. Thank you so much. You took part in the panel Women's Empowerment Through Film. What message did you want to share? The message is that we support each other because, you know, in the Middle East sometimes, or in the world, that women sometimes not not encouraging each other. And this is a problem. So we're just standing by each other now and we should do more in this industry. So that's why we made the panel. How difficult is it to be a woman in this industry? Walk me through the challenges that women can face. Women always struggle. You know, it's part of our life. Uh, successful women struggle more because they need to have a sharp vision and to know exactly what they want. I never knew what I really want, but I all, always know what I don't want. And this is half the road. So when you know what you don't want, you get clearer vision of yourself. A lot of movies stereotype Arab women in both MENA and international cinema. How do you think this can change? From creativity. We, our job is to create, to create personalities. It's all about creativity. Sometimes because most of the women themselves became a stereotype of themselves, you know, in, to, in their countries. So they became like, not dull, like poor thinking or just a narrow way of thinking. And this is really, really bad because it doesn't, it doesn't help your, your mentality to grow. Uh, there is a kind of woman who can accept being weak. There is another woman who cannot accept being weak. There is independent women. Minna, you are an icon for women and standing up for women's rights with so often victim of sexual harassment being forced to be silent. What inspired you to speak up? I'm, I'm a lady, I'm a girl. And uh, before I'm a girl, I'm a, human, I'm a human being. I cannot accept someone to touch me even like this. Without me, I, I want to. Even a girl, not a man. So what we miss here is the, uh, the human rights. By the way, for women and men, because there is a lot of harassment for men, but they cannot say because of you're a man, you cannot say because of judgment. So what we are victim of in, the, in our Arab world that we cannot speak because we've been judged, even we are the victim. So, Mina, how can we change this? With loud voice, would say, you cannot, you know something, you cannot l teach me the wrong. So I got a fear to say loud that you are wrong because you're very strong on being wrong. This is a big problem. I cannot be afraid that I'm a woman. I'm a woman and I like to be a woman and God create me as a woman. So why should I be afraid that I'm a woman to be well-dressed or dressed the way I want? Because you have a sick mentality. So we always talk and we always share and we always say this is wrong. We, we hope we change it. Minna Shalabi, thanks so much for your time today. Thank you, my pleasure. Thank you so much.